Hello and welcome to OAP Gaming and The Last Remnant Remastered. In today's episode what we're going to do is we're going to continue on from the last video. We got Seething Wind, we got Nightingale, we got all the drops and splits, we did the 18 Bannikins and we did the 8 Wailing Lava, so all that's left is 16 Manhunters. So what I'm going to do, as I always do, is I'm going to make a save here. And you will join me when the Manhunters have spawned. I will show you the first couple of battles. But then you will join me again when I've done all 16. Because it's going to take a while and I'm sure you don't want to see me fighting the same one over and over and over again. So... I will see you when the Manhunters have spawned. So there's the Manhunter, which has decided to disappear on me. So what I'll do, I'll run round to do this one and then come back for that one. Hate it when they disappeared on you. Let's do this. And we also want tanned archfiend hide from these. And we got nothing from that one. Like I said, they only ever spawn two at a time. And only spawn there and here. Has this one reappeared? Yes, it has. Okay, let's go for it. Let's do this. Oh, we've got some crabs by the look of it as well. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes, we have. That's fine. We can, um... We can take them out Let's first. Kick some a. Check this out, you like that? Whoa! Than that. <laughs> that was boring. I must surpass my mother. Well, we want five of those Mystic Fiend horns. And what we got here? And we didn't get what we want from those. But that's fine. We will get them. 
eventually. Now they only spawn two at a time and I had to zone in and out a long time. So what you can do, you can come say here and if you wait three or four minutes, they will respawn. Which means I have to do this in real time so you can see for yourself. So while we're doing that, let me just do my usual trick. Oh, I must already have some of those. Okay. Oh, shout flower of Talon. You can go up there. There we go. So, if you hang around here, like I say, for three minutes, possibly four, those manhunters will respawn. So once I've shown you that they do respawn, I'll end the recording and you will join me back when I've got all 16 and obtained the tanned archfiend hind because we need 10 of them i know it's a bit boring and i'm trying desperately to think of what else can i tell you what can i talk about i really don't know you may think well why hang around here for three or four minutes for them to spawn it actually is quicker because i had to zone in and out of here at least seven or eight times for them to spawn and if you don't get the drops you know you're doing it again and it could be it could take 20 turns it is all rng based and if the rng is against you then you could literally be here half an hour 40 minutes waiting for them to spawn and when you think that you have to get 16 of them for the guild task it can take a long time even waiting three or four minutes tells you how long it's going to take you so but it's up to you all i'm doing is pointing out that if you wait three or four minutes here or somewhere else where monsters don't spawn it will automatically respawn rares do not respawn so you can't do it that way unfortunately so uh anyway what else can i say um Except that I hope you're enjoying the playthrough. Uh, hit the like button, leave a comment, subscribe. And uh, any questions, leave them in the comments as well. Uh, still waiting for the three minutes. Um, I have a stopwatch on my phone which I'm using to time for the three minutes. Yes, in the next episode, I might as well just tell you what we're going to do in the, in the next episode. We'll be doing uh, some more side quests. We'll be doing the Cosmo Fest, which is a, a good one. And we'll, if we have time, we'll be going into Nagapur uh, to collect <laughs> some more uh, monsters for uh, guild tasks. Uh, well, that's... Uh, Three minutes well and truly up so they should have respawned do not let me down do not let me down are you hiding or have you respawned have you respawned or are you just hiding again do not make me out to be a liar because i've done this many times and you've always respawned there it is there you go we've waited there and let's do this i may as well just do this one to show you so there you go you see standing in that spot there will make it respawn so i'll just show you this one and then you can rejoin me when we've got all 16 and the drops and splits we require come on finish them off See that? I'm constantly growing stronger. And we didn't get the tan darts behind here either. So, I will see you back when we've done all 16 and I have the tan darts behind as well.
So that's the 16 manhunt manhunters taken care of. We got the tanned arch fiend hind we needed. So we've got 11 of them. If you haven't already got arch fiend meat, you need at least two. I got some more from the manhunters, but I already had some. So everything's good there. So with that taken care of, let's move on. And the next side quest we're going to do is we have to go to Nagapur and we're going to be doing the Cosmo Maiden. And as usual, we have to go to the pub. And we talk to this gentleman here. So we are transported to Club Friend. So basically, all you have to do is to find the Cosmo Maiden, whose name is Cheryl, and then exit out of this exit here. But what we're going to do, we are going to take on an enemy called Barze, because we need some war dragon fangs, and we also need a pixie corp. And that's a split from Barze. So Cheryl is just down here. There she is. Now, this is a quest which you can abuse the Barze spawn. If you leave out of that exit, it will cancel the quest and you come back. And Barze will spawn again. So you can abuse it if you like. But we're not going to do that. Not for this anyway. There's Barze. Let's do this! And we're going to fight him. I'll... Um. I'll Attack, probably maybe? have to fight it more than once because we need four War Dragon Fangs and I've never gotten all four out of one fight but I'll just show the first one as usual I won't show you the others What the hell? 
The one thing about Barze is he is a guaranteed capture. He I just respawns, which means you can actually farm him because you can sell him for a big chunk of gold. I'll tell you that now. And I do know that a lot of people do farm Barze for that very reason. should strike at their flank. together. I must surpass my mother. <laughs> So we got three war dragon fangs, we needed four. I've never got four, I think three is the, about the maximum you can have. And we need a pixie core, there we go. We need that as well. So we almost got everything we wanted. So I am going to have to come back in to get the war dragon fang, which we're missing. But I will, as usual, I shall do that when I'm not recording. So, just run out of here. Out of this exit here. And that ends the quest. And we got a javelin and 5,000 gold. <laughs> so 
So, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> so we've got the um, War Dragon Fangs. We defeated Barze. I'm going to have to go back in to get the one we're missing. I shall do that off when I'm not recording, should I say. So I think um, I shall end this episode here. Uh, if you've liked the the video, please, well, leave a like. You know, I can't put a sentence together to save my life today. <laughs> leave a comment. Good, bad, or indifferent, I do appreciate them all. If you have any questions about the game, please put them in the comment section too, and I will do my very best to answer them for you. Even consider subscribing. It costs you nothing. It's totally free, and I know you want to see how this game ends. So, hopefully I will see you in the next episode. Until then, thank you so much for watching. It really is appreciated.